What's going on guys and welcome back. Thought I'd throw in another video this week, bonus video for your Sunday. Something really mysterious in the mail today. This is a gift by my friends over at Art of Play. So in this box, I opened it up and to my amusement, I received this little red bag and in this on this bag is a tag that reads as follows. Just a little thanks for all the love you show the community. Keep being awesome. Dan and Dave. So as I open this bag, I realized that there was a lovely puzzle inside. This is actually a level 10 puzzle by puzzle maker Jean-Claude Constantin. Uh, he makes a numerous amount of puzzles, usually all working with wood, and his style of puzzle is very traditional and very classic, sort of. You get a lot of string and ball puzzles or ring puzzles or like this one, a maze puzzle. The goal here is to shift around these bolts to eventually slide out these plastic lids and reveal what's inside. Now, Dan and Dave have thrown a little bit of a surprise in here because inside this box, you can perfectly fit two decks of playing cards. Uh, there seems to only be one in here and it looks like a mystery deck. Kind of excited to see what's inside, but before we do, obviously, we're gonna have to solve this level 10 puzzle, so it's not gonna be easy unless I smash it on the ground, which I'm not inclined to do. So without any further ado, I'm actually really excited to get into this because I wanna see what the heck lays inside this puzzle, so. Uh, if you like this video, like this content, like, subscribe, all that stuff, and let's get into solving this maze puzzle. Here we go, this little maze puzzle by Jean-Claude Constantine, sent to me by my pals over at Art of Play as a bit of a thank you. As I mentioned, there is a secret deck of cards in here. They've got like uh, their logo and little question marks on that deck, so I, I don't know what deck that is. I look forward to seeing what deck that is before anything. The inaugural timer. Okay. So, first thing I gather is that there are two things that need to slide out here, one and two. So I have to maneuver them, except the one thing is, is that when you move one of these, they both move. So that's, that's the challenge here. Now I know I can move that down and see it gets stuck there. Okay, so I'll need to be able to move that up. Now I'll need to move this. Oh, that doesn't, wait, no. Oh. Maybe if I go halfway, then I can move it like this. Then I can move that. And then. Oh, I see. Hmm. Tricky. That brings me back here. Okay. Boom, 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 boom. I want you in my room. Oh, I see, I see. This goes halfway. so that this can move. No, because that's still stuck. Right, can't move that. Gotta move that one over here so I can move that up, but it's stuck by this. Cause that one's over there, everyone's over there except for this one. So, I think I gotta go back in time here. Why won't this move up now? Cause of that one, boom. Now I move that there. Now I can. But now this one, now, there we go, boom. Which brings me to my first piece that I can move if I move halfway. I should be able to. There we go. Okay, we're getting there. Um, I still need to move this down, so it won't move down because of this, so, and because of this one. 
Hmm. So if I move this one here, is that possible? In order to move that one there, I would have to do this, bring it back here, then bring it here. Now I can move that down, right? There we go. <laughs> okay, next step. Where's the next step? Oh, just realized this won't go up any further. Oh, this has to come out this way. I've been going at it backwards. Oh man, okay. This one has to come out this way and that one has to, because of this, has to extract. See, this one doesn't have an extractor point. So how do I get there is what I wanna know. So that's not moving because of that, right? Wait, why is that stuck? Huh? Okay. Should probably focus on just the one. So, why is that stuck there? It's like halfway. It doesn't... Why is it halfway? There we go. No, other way. Hmm, I've got to get this one out here before I can start pulling it out. Uh, that's what I have to do. Okay, all right, no biggie, no biggie, no biggie. Hmm, okay. Requires a lot of backwards thinking doing these things. So if this one wants to pull it there, that has to go like this. No, because that one's blocking there. You're right, that will go down. So therefore, oh, I see, okay. This one. Would have to go in here first. Right. I think that one over here is gonna be rather tricky.
Oh my goodness. Okay, I've got that one cleared. That's good, that's a good sign. Um, now to get it out of that maze. Kinda gets stuck here. It's not supposed to get stuck. Like right here on the corner, that wood's getting stuck. All right, there we go. This one has to come out. But I gotta get this one down so it loops through here. Yes. Okay, getting there.
one of them out. Now I guess the other one should be quite simple. It's gotta come this way. Oh, it just unlocks. Look at that, okay. <laughs> there we go. Ooh, look at this. Look at this. Oh wow. Here is the mystery deck that they have sent me. Get out of here. Are you kidding me? No way. This is an original Jerry's Nuggets. What? I did, I did not expect this. Holy cow. All right, so for those of you who don't know, Jerry's Nuggets is the rarest deck on the planet. These decks retail from around $500 a piece. Look at this thing, it's like, it's falling up. The plastic's falling off right now because it's so old. Yeah, these are like the rarest collectible. This is like the Wayne Gretzky rookie card of playing cards right here. Are you kidding me? <gasps> wow. <laughs> I did not expect to get this. I was just thinking some random deck. That is, a dude, art of play. <gasps> oh no. That's incredible. I'm not even gonna open this. I'm just gonna try not to manhandle this whatsoever. Yeah, I'm kind of in awe right now. Uh, <laughs> this deck's supposed to fit two decks of cards, which is really cool. I think before I put it together, I'm gonna put this aside. I'm gonna throw in two decks in there and a couple of first playing cards. Boom, that is wicked. Now this has to, get in there somehow. Does that fit nice and snug? There we go. And this one uh, was like this. And then we gotta kinda place it all back. There we go. Back to the beginning. We got some first playing cards in there. Uh, probably took me an extra like five minutes. Not too bad, pretty sick. This is an insane surprise. It says here, there's always more mystery. Uh, yeah, totally caught me off guard with this. Insane, wow. All right, there it is. What? <laughs> I'm not gonna do that anymore. Wow, I'm smiling ear to ear uh, because of this. An original Jerry's Nuggets deck of cards. I, I never owned an original Jerry's Nuggets deck of playing cards, so this is actually really cool. I'm gonna put it on my shelf in, uh, in that nice little glass casing. Yeah, speechless. It's literally falling apart. Look at the plastic coming off that like uh, i want to say a big thank you to art of play guys if you uh if you want puzzles or playing cards i left their link below they've got a whole assortment including this one which isn't too pricey for a level 10 i think it retails at around 50 bucks so you guys can check that out i'll leave the link below uh, but really cool for them you know to send me uh one of these super super rare decks that i don't even have so i'm elated i'm very happy it was definitely worth uh going through the maze i you know, I didn't find it that difficult. I really do enjoy these maze and bolt puzzles you gotta shift around the pieces to because uh, they require you to act logically. There's no random sequence here. You, you really have to think it through from beginning to end. I didn't find it that difficult. I would probably rate it around level eight. Maybe some of you uh, will have an easier time or a harder time. It all depends. We're all, we're all sort of different when it comes to solving puzzles. But yeah, nonetheless, super fun, really surprised. Hope you guys enjoyed this video. Little bonus video on the weekend. Stay tuned for tomorrow's video where uh, I've got a surprise for tomorrow as well, which kind of, it kind of fits today's video. You'll see tomorrow. We'll see you then. Peace. Bye.